Hello, this is Brenda DeArmond, and I'm at Pembroke Fairways here in Leesburg. It's 80 degrees today, and, and it's the end of January, so I hope all you people in the north are jealous. And I'll go through, and we're going to take a little tour, and if you want to see anything, uh, we got single-family homes, we got mobile homes, we got villas, anything you want. And I'll give you the particulars at the end of the video. We're walking to the gate right now to see the beautiful trees here. This is a 55 and up neighborhood. Very relaxing. This is at the front. People are coming and going right off of 44, which is a major highway. And you have your own beauty salon, a spa, right here at the front of the neighborhood. Don't have to go very far. Most of these buildings you can't get in anyway because of the COVID. Here's uh, one I was able to take a picture of all the library books here. Here's the fitness center. Go in there and work out. Not sure you can even get in it because all the buildings are closed right now because of COVID. Here's a basketball court. You like to shoot hoops. And then all the tennis courts here at the front. Here's one of the activity buildings that you can't get into right now. Everything's pretty if you could look at it. And here's the shuffleboard court. You don't see too many people out playing today on some of these items, but they're doing a lot of walking around and riding bikes. Here's one of the swimming pools. There's two swimming pools here. This is a smaller pool at the beginning. It looks like they're doing some cleaning right now and all the equipment there that you can use. sit down and uh, sit on the bench there and play bocce ball. That seems to be a popular sport in the 55 plus community. And as you walk down the aisle there, uh, you're in with the manufactured homes. Uh, so if you had one of these manufactured homes, uh, you're just right behind the activity center. And they're very nice. And people are here. Some people are here all year round and some people just come for the summer. Communication center, they're not giving speeches in there, they're, they're receiving mail. Their communication is the, the mail hub. And right in front of that, that's a beautiful tree. They've got a sign there as how special that tree is. So since, since they told me it was special, I figured, boy, that must be special. So I should take a picture. And it is, it is very, unique here we've got the horseshoe court right there by that unique tree as you can see facilities are closed because of covid that that doesn't deter anyone from walking around and doing some other items a lot of water there a lot of ponds See all the people driving around, they're, they're not letting any grass grow under their feet. More ponds, lots of ponds. A lot of people on their bicycles as well. Bicycles, tricycles, whatever you want. Here's a little snippet of what the houses look like. These are like the stick belt homes. And a lot of them have uh, the garages with screens on them. There's some different types of homes here. These are some of the larger homes. Maybe they have they have stucco on those. So, you know, the houses can get up to 2,400 square feet here. And they're overlooking the golf course. There's three nine-hole golf courses here. And a lot of people are out there playing golf today, enjoying life. Here's another area here. 
This is back in the back. This is the grand hall. Not too grand right now because nobody's in there enjoying being the grand. But this is where they have uh, the larger pool here. It's very nice. But the grand hall is where they have all the, a lot of the activities. They have uh, dances and people that come in and perform for you. Pitch in food when it's open. And this is the front of it. Give you a little uh, tour of the side and what they have here, because just on the other side here is another golf course. Lots and lots of golf courses, lots and lot of water. Just relaxing if you just want to sit here and look at it. This is uh, for all the people that have been in the military. You can see they've tried to use every branch of the service to honor them for being in the military. It's a nice display here. Something for everyone. And if you've been in the military, we certainly thank you for your service. And right in the center is a big flagpole. I have to st stand back, way back, because it's really a very tall flagpole. I think I can get up there and, and see what's cooking here. It's nice. Here's a memorial garden that they have. If you can buy a brick and you can be included in it, or you can get a bench. So for some reason, this went sideways, but that's the best I could do sideways bench but it's sitting up straight but uh, in honor of someone you can uh, donate a brick of some sort and ones for the uh, military as well as for anyone else and they have this bench here and it's uh, very serene you could sit there and you can look out over um, the water they have a lot of a lot of water and it, it's a water effect out there spraying up. Wish I would have made this a little bit better, but this the uh, it wanted to do what it wanted to do without my approval. Here's another bench. I saw several benches there. Well, that was Pembroke. Uh, there's over 1,200 homes in there, so there's something for everyone. There's mobile homes. You can call it mobile homes, manufactured home, trailer, whatever you want to call that. They're mobile homes or manufactured homes. There's uh, villas, and there's homes. There's uh, stick bell homes, and there's some some with stucco on them. So anything that you want. There's uh, three nine-hole golf courses, and abundance of all kinds of activities, any kind of activity that you would want. And that is uh, closer to the villages. If you've ever heard of the villages, it's one of the largest retirement communities in the country. I don't know how it compares with the world, but there's all kinds of activities. And if you live in the area, then you can partake in some of those activities. Prices are a lot less at Pembroke. They start at 85,000 and go up to uh, probably 280,000 at this point. But prices keep going up and up and up and um, every, every week you think, well, I'm not gonna get 285 for that. And all of a sudden 285 is what you get because the prices are going up and inventory is very low. Right now the um, interest rates are low. So if you're interested in buying a home and wanting to get a mortgage, you want to take advantage of those interest rates. We have single family homes again. Uh, the square footage is 708 square footage, which is probably the, the manufactured homes and over 2,200 square feet. So there's a lot to choose from. And if you have any questions on this or any other 55 plus community, 
give me a call. I'm Brenda DeArmond. I've been a broker for over 40 years in two different states. And if I don't know the answer, I can bug somebody and I'll find out the answers. My phone number is 407-721-2128 and my email and my um, webpage is below here. So call me or check out my webpage. If you're looking for any of the other 55 plus communities or this one, all you have to do is click on their name and it'll give you what's in the multiple listing service at this time. Bye and I will hopefully send you another one shortly.